One of the most common fractures to occur in an old age patient is the neck of the femur fracture. This is usually seen in osteoporotic patients. As you can see in this x-ray, the neck is fractured here. If you look at the hip, you can see that this is the head of the femur, this is the neck of the femur, this is the shaft of the femur, and these are the trochanters. So whenever there is a neck of femur fracture, the surgeons mostly go for a replacement procedure rather than fixation, just like a normal fracture. Why is this so? Because the blood supply to the head of the femur, the majority of the blood supply comes through the neck. And whenever there is a fracture occurring at the neck, this will disrupt the whole blood supply to the head of the femur. And over the few months course, the patient's head will start degenerating and it will cause worse symptoms with fixation. So, we will always go for a replacement procedure rather than a fixation procedure. So, if this is the fracture, as you can see here, you will take off the head, take out the head, measure the head size and then take an implant of the appropriate size and then fix it in place of the head. And sometimes we will also use a bone cement to stabilize the prosthesis inside the shaft of the femur.